of reinstating one of my old poems because I was not prepared. I apologize for that, but so here goes nothing. <laughs> Tick and tick-tock goes the clock as my thoughts come knocking at this time bringing reality into my mind the clock strikes 12 beckoning me to rest my mind is tired and overstressed in my eyes my eyes are bloodshot red so I lie there in bed pillow caressing my head but my mind like my computer computer refuses to go to sleep My thoughts come down like a raspberry rain. Rain. They form a deluge, a flood inside of my brain, but not a rain of water, no. This rain is of a different color. This rain of black and blue hues. This rain that is used to write DBQs. This rain is what you might think. This rain is also known as ink. So while that ink on that essay begins to dry, I lie there in bed, my thoughts continue to fly. I think about whether I should study A-Push now or then, and I think about whether or not I forgot to do trick again. <laughs> and then I think about the, pa the password for the school's Wi-Fi, where their paranoia will probably be, end up being the square root of negative pi. <laughs> so anyway, I lie there in bed, thoughts filling my head, and I, I can't help but wonder why. Why is the sky a blue hue? Is it sad like me, or is it sad like you? And who? Who was the first one to tell a, a lie and back to why? Why can't I get good grades? Why can't I learn to fly? Why can't I be a jack of all trades? And why can't a man cry? Why can't I be the one you need? And why can't I be the one to exceed? Why can't I be the one who is great? And why can't I seem to rid myself of this self-hate? Why can't I be you? And why can't I happy about being me? And why can't I just stop myself, confining myself and just let myself be free? But most importantly, I have an AP tomorrow and one next week. So why can't I let myself fall fast, fast asleep? <laughs> Time continues to pass by, changing between different speeds, sometimes seeming to take off and fly, other times seeming to grow like a baby seed. So I stare at the clock, unable to sleep or walk, just wondering about life and why life has to be so full of strife, and wondering how at this rate anybody could possibly write an essay earning a score of eight. <laughs> 132, 334, I simply can't take it anymore. I toss and I turn, I hope and I yearn for an answer to my prayers to initiate sleep and end my despair. I need sleep now, but I wonder how I can... I mean, what I mean to say is... Finally, I went under. But then, faintly, like the sound of far off thunder, a voice comes in to disturb my slumber. Curious, I lay there listening, and what came next was absolutely terrifying. It was the sound of La Llorona and Bloody Mary, only twice as loud and twice as scary, for the sound that disturbed my slumber was the sound of my ever so punctual mother saying, James, es el tiempo de levantarte, por aquí se me tienes que Dios me ayude.